And we're back with episode two of the adventures of White Wolf and Pervert Bug. Let's go check out Kamiki Village to make sure everyone is um, hanging in there. After us, you know, bringing life back to the entire village. My controller's gonna die any second now. Uh, let's see, who should we talk to first? Let's talk to this lovely lady over here. Oh man. What the hell kind of voice would that gibberish lend itself to? Mushi's mama says, I've had just about enough of this. I don't know. Jesus. Her voice. I don't know if it's stray dogs or monsters or what, but someone keeps messing up my crops. Going around digging holes with triangle. God, it makes me mad. If I catch you digging around here, you'll get a good thumping. Take that. Woo! What, are you not gonna do anything? You're not gonna chase me? You didn't come all the way out here to find food, did you? Well, so long as you don't start digging holes with the triangle button, you can do what you want as far as I'm concerned. Okay. I take it this is your lovely son, madam? What, you got a dragonfly tied to a string? I'm gonna report this child to the local SPCA, or PETA. Or some animal rights group, dragonfly rights group. Huh? A white wolf? No, that's just plain weird. She looks like a weak little bugger. Think you could beat my dog Hayabusa? Well, listen to this. There's this field my mama tends to, you see? Well, Hayabusa managed to dig up nine turnips in a row, even though my mama was chasing him around trying to slug him. There are actually ten turnips in that field. Hayabusa is fixin' to get all ten. Think you could dig up all the turnips in my mama's field? Don't forget. That sounded really weird. You think you can dig up all my mom's turnips, do ya? You'll have to avoid being slugged by my mom. I'll admit you're the better canine if you can do it. Ugh, she's gonna try to slug us? Not exactly my idea of a good time, Amy. At least you have your celestial brush and wicked brush stroke. So anytime there's a the little triangle appears, little green triangle appears above someone's head when you speak to them, it means we've got more to say. Some information. Hey, Hayabusa, what's up? Can I bite you? <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, no! Sorry, Hayabusa. I didn't know. Oh, but he looks very excited. Can I bark at you? Wait. Can I... If I... I don't want to feed you, Hayabusa. Whatever, I'm digging up some turnips. Okay, so the record of beat is 10. Should be easy. You me frantically spamming the... Tr yes, I know, I'm... This is not the time game! Ooh. I think I can just... Paint her to distract her. No, wait, hold on. I gotta aim for face properly. Come on. Come on. Beautiful. <laughs> Dig up two. Oh, 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 oh. oh, come on. That was totally on her face. Maybe if I just put a single dot on her face, it'll distract her. Nope, okay. There we go. I think if I go too far away from this field, um, it resets the game. So I gotta be careful of that. Nope. Jesus, lady, you are vicious! Don't act this way in front of your son. Show some restraint. Bad influence to your own child. I don't think so. Ooh. Give me that turnip. Two more. Where is she? God, this music is intense. Come on. Nine. One more. One more. One more. One more. Yes. I think I gotta pick it up and take it to. Mushi, whatever his name is. Yoink. All right, what do you think? I offered oddly shaped turnip. Hey, that's that's the oddly shaped turnip Hayabusa and I've been looking for. That means you've broken Hayabusa's record by digging up all the turnips. Gosh darn it! Fine, you're the better canine. Anyway, it actually feels good to have a new goal to aim for. What's your new goal? You gonna tell me? Behold, the new king of hole digging, Snowy. Your name shall go down in history here in Kamiki Village. 
Okay, I'm gonna need another shrine. A turnip shaped shrine to honor my um, excellent crop harvesting ability. Home of the Elder. Mr. Orange lives here. He's a regular village celebrity. This village has exceedingly low standards. Who lives here? Home of Hayabusa, the greatest ho Why am I reading it in Eastern's voice? Home of Hayabusa, the greatest holding in Kamigi. Not anymore. This is Moose's hand riding. That's so, that's so cute. His mom let him ride on the sign. Aww. I love this little interaction. Let me see if I can scare her with a bark. No. Okay, I can't really talk to her. Cushy! Well, what a fine looking wolf. What's your name? Mine's Cushy. It's a pleasure to meet you. Sake Brewer Cushy. Working in the field again, are ya? Yes, soon are you and the wolf together? Well, I mean... We live together. This is where I grew the rice for making my sake, you know. But I have to manage the harvest all on my own. It's hard work. I need a strong white wolf and a tiny anorexic little glowing green pervert to help me. Maybe I should have Susano give me a hand again this year. Oh, listen to me blabbering on. I just can't help chatting to you. Well, Amy, I think you find a friend here. You'll meet many people who want to talk to you like this. You should talk to them two or even three times. Being a god and all, you can actually tell when to talk because you'll see a triangle above their head. That means they still have something to say. It might even be valuable information sometimes. They may just be muttering to themselves, but it pays to listen. A.K.A. this is how we get hints. Look how beautiful this lake is. Lake? Body of water? Small body of water? Anyway, it's sort of cushy again. Susano's the neighbor of mine. He's a little unusual, but he goes around with a huge sword slung over his shoulder. He's always practicing with him. They say he's a direct descendant of our legendary hero, Nagi, and he loves his sake too. We haven't pops around here to bite. Here, oh, you scared me. Sorry, Cushy, but, um... I'm better than the Susano fellow, which you speak. Oh, man. <laughs> I forgot you can drag people around. Make sure to say hello when you hear... See, Susano, you could use a friend, I should think. He's always on his own. He's a bit of a neat. A bit of a neat, the Susano. What do you got inside your house there, Cushy? Oh, this is more of like a, a brewery than a house. I think she... No, this... Yeah, her house is a separate building. I remember you can, um... Pop in there and... Watch her sleep if, if that's... Your idea of entertainment. Uh, let me go outside and repair this water wheel. Help my darling Cushy. Uh, what's the best angle? This should be fine. La 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 Jealous Isun? Yeah, I see it. I see the jealousy in your eyes. What do you think? What's this? The mill's been mended. Who on earth did that? I completely given up on the idea of making my sake, but now I can get on with polishing. Polishing the rice? I don't know how to make sake. Well, no time like the present. I better get started. You're gonna need to move a bit faster than that, Cushy. Just a little bit of impetus. 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 See how she's doing. I didn't get any praise for that, or did I? How there, darling. Yeah, rub my face. You're interested in how to brew sake, are you, Snowy? Well, this thing here is for polishing the rice, you see. Oh, well, I'll tell you what, I've got something I think you'll like. Hee <laughs> hee, it's just some leftover stock from the store. But I made it myself. It's called Fist of the Gods! Oh, but are you even old enough to drink, Snowy? I am 85 in dog years. Actually, I'm probably really old considering I'm a god. I'm not gonna need this now, so I'll just leave it there. Can I talk to you one more time? Mm, no, no, I can't. Jeez, relax, lady. I'm just jumping. Okay, uh, just trying to get all this extra little stuff out the way in the village. Get as much praise as possible. Upgrade some of my stuff. I think this old woman wants me to draw a washing line. A white wolf. Wait. A white wolf. Now that's a rare sight. Did you come down from the mountains just to play with us? Well, you'd better be careful, dear. Lately, some monsters have been attacking the villagers. Do you even know who you're talking to, Grandma? This year, I'll be sure no remorse. And the wolf and I haven't covered those monsters in history. Well, if it isn't you, so and riding a wolf, are we? This one certainly resembles Shiranui, especially the nose. The nose? That's unusual. 
Hmm, well, I'd better get back to my work. Oh, arthritis. I love the, the singing she does. Let me see if I can trigger it again. There it is. Beautiful singing voice, ma'am. I smell a, a future in the, the record. The record industry, as they say. You have to listen to the ramblings of an old woman, are you? Nah, just your soothing voice, Grandma. Your nose looks pretty interesting. Well, I was doing the laundry, but when it was ready to dry, I noticed my dry, dry, drying pulp's gone. Oh, whatever. Oh, whatever shall I do? I need to keep. I need to keep these voices consistent. Where did that darn pole go? How could something important like that just disappear? Hmm, she's missing something that should be there, is she? You better help her out for a while. All right. Where is it? Sevier. Oops. Oops. <laughs> That's fine. That'll do. A new drying pot. Oh my, where did that come from? The gods must have answered my prayers. How wonderful. Good. Sweet cheese. You are athletic for your age. Time to dry the laundry. Well, I'm glad I was able to hang my laundry, but the sun seems to be so far away these days. Yeah, you know. The sun does move further away from us, depending on the time of day. This is... a fact. Maybe it doesn't like all those monsters that are lurking about. If only it would shine closer, my donkey would dry in a second. Don't worry, I'll just pull the sun a bit closer, Bruce Almighty style. My laundry would dry in a jiffy if the sun would just shine closer. You heard the lady, she wants the sun! Time to use you-know-what! Magic? Alright, here's your stupid sun lady. It's in the exact same position. My word! The sun has suddenly drawn so close, my laundry would be bone dry in no time. First my pole, and now this. Will the miracles never cease? Maybe I ought to make some cherry cakes to offer to the sun. Come back tonight if you want some too, Snowball. No one makes better cherry cakes than mouth-watering good. Mouth-wateringly good, Grandma. Your English is... lacking. Goodness, you're just full of pep, aren't you? All right. I think that's almost everyone in this village. Um, Mr. Orange is dead. Mrs. Orange is making some cherry cakes. We dug up all the turnips. Mushy's enjoying his dragonfly on a string. We repaired the thingy, the, the water wheel. Let's check this sign quickly. Cushy Sake House. They say the suck is so good that people come from as far as the capital city to buy it. Um, let's just let's go to Susano. Probably save two years. Okay. Let's check out Susano. The Great Warrior. Ha! <laughs> I see what you did there, game. Jeez, it's not even spelled right. Classic Susano. Something that... Sheesh, he's always snoring like a bear. This is the home of the two-bit middle-aged warrior, Susano, who goes around claiming to be a descendant of Nagi. He's famous around here for his lineage, but he's awfully lazy and too off the wall to be a descendant of a legendary hero. Now, now we soon? Now you're right, you're absolutely right. Uh, nothing back here? This I can do something with later on. I can get over there later on. Okay, let's just go inside. Gotta move the plot along a bit before we start doing any of the, um... Size stuff that requires a lot of the powers, the brush techniques that we haven't got yet. Uh, he is down here. <laughs> I love this music as well. Oh, bumbling Susano. What will you get up to next? <sighs> I am the greatest. Oh, cushy, let's... Mm -hmm. Whoa, looks like he ain't waking up any time soon. He's out cold. Okay. Yeah, alright. Oh. If that didn't wake him, nothing will. Let's just leave him for a while and find something else to do. Okay. See, this is what I mean, like... It's some moments like this that you... That you forget, even after you've played... 
this game so many times. Like, you gotta see Susano, and then you gotta do something else. What, what is it that I need to do? Uh, let's check out these houses so long. Anybody home? Nope. No, if his mama catches you snacking, she'll clobber you good. Mushi's mom is very violent. She's a very violent woman. She should be the uh, the war strategist if this village ever decides to, I don't know, embark on some small-scale military invasion. This is the orange, orange family's house, I think. So you come every night if you want cherry cakes. I will not be doing that more than once. Because there's no point. No point whatsoever. Oh, wait a minute. This, this is what i got to do. It's the boulder down here, I think. I've got to talk to this guy right at the end of the village. He's trying to push the giant rock out of the way. Yeah, there he is. Talk to me, sir. Who the heck put this big rock here? It's blocking the only road out of the village. Doesn't look like you could squeeze through anywhere. Besides, I don't even know if it's safe to leave the village yet. Okay. <sighs> this is weird. My mind really wants to shit this rock, but my body won't cooperate. It's like I'm made of lead. Could this be a case of demonic possession? I sure hope not. Musical demons. The most treacherous of all demons. Excuse me, ma'am. It's a family friendly show, I'll have you know. I didn't get that guy. I didn't get him. I didn't get him. I consumed cabbage. Thick and fibrous vegetable. Great for gas. I consume ginseng, roots, blah, 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 blah. Lordy, he did. Okay, now it should progress the story. Oh, yes. We are giving this village a makeover. More praise. I accumulated praise. Whoa, I'm you suddenly start glowing. That means your divine attributes can be enhanced. Well, you should look excited. Yeah, I'll show you what I mean. Let's take a stab at enhancing your divine attributes. I'm gonna open the fan menu where you'll see it, blah, 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 blah. Use the praise you've accumulated to enhance your attributes you want. Yep, I get it, I get it. Uh, I'm gonna enhance my... Ink pouch. For now. Well, is it all coming back to you, what? Hmm, it's hard to connect. It's hard. It's hard to notice such a small enhancement. Oh, lighten up for a while. This is one big step. Are you telling me she responded to you soon? Or are you just engaging in some serious mental issues? Yeah, talking to a non-responding god wolf. Look, look at her. Look at her. She's not even paying attention to you, Isun. She's like looking all around. She's like, oh my god, where's where's the closest place like a piss and shit? Ooh, ooh, that butterfly looks particularly tasty. This is one big step for the new and improved Amaterasu. Keep up the good work. Oh, I almost forgot we better check in on that dude. Now, we check on this guy. Ah, I feel as light as a feather now. Sadly, that doesn't make it any easier to shift this ball. Who went and blocked the only path out of you anyway? There's no way I can get back to the city now. Say, pup, your owner lives here in the village, right? So you must know that guy, Suzano. Can you get him to come here? They say he's the descendant of the legendary Hironagi. If anyone can do something about this Ruxin. That's strange. This bowler wasn't here before. Anything else to say to me, Mr. Boulder Man? You want to get out of your 2D pup? Then go fetch that guy called Susano for me. Okie dokie, will do. Susano is the man with the plan to move the boulder. That is. Yep. <laughs> this music is such a drastic change of atmosphere and, and, and tone. I am the greatest. Oh, yeah, I've read this. Let's wake this guy up. Okay. What the? Huh? Oh, no. I can't speed up the dialogue. Oh, I feel so well rested. I plan to meditate underground, but fell fast asleep. Oh, who are you? And what business do you have with Suzano, the greatest warrior ever? <laughs> it should really be, um... Quotation marks all around around the Great Warrior. 
Do even the beasts know of my great exploits now? Well, Fido. Huh. I'm not looking for apprentices. I'm, I'm just wondering what the, the the original Japanese line said for that. Maybe you call him like a like a, a cute word for a dog. He's no way in hell he called him Fido in the Japanese uh, version of the game. Go back to the mountains and play with your monkey friends. How dare a mangy moth like you interrupt my meditation. Get a lot of this guy. <laughs> it's his voice. Get a load of this guy, brown and no brights. Quit messing around and come with us. Mm, you snuck in here again? Quit bugging me, you... You... Bug. Good job. Good job. Good job, Scizor. I told you, don't call me a bug. Come on, I'm it. We're taking him with us. Taking you by force, Susano. What do you think you're doing? Put me down this instant. What will the neighbors think? They really, they really think almost nothing of you, Susano. There's, there's really nothing at stake here. You're worried about your reputation. Look at you. Look at you. You're a mess. All right. Time for you to prove your Nagi's descent and destroy this boulder, please. You mangy mod, you brought me all the way here just to test yourself against me? Then prepare to taste the wrath of my trusty blade, Tohen Boku. Hold on a minute, you're the legendary Suzano. Yep, not all the Suzano, the greatest warrior who ever lived, and by the way, never interrupt warriors engaged in battle. But I've got a favor to ask you. This huge boulder block in the path is really getting in my way. Can't you do something about it? What? Come on, please. I mean, you want Nagi's descendant, aren't you? Surely one stone's no match for your mighty stone. Stones! Merchant, this is not a stone. This is like a mini mountain. Hmm. It is certainly not beyond my ability. Really? Great. Okay, then no time like the present. Go for it. Wait. A boulder of the size is not very easy, even for me. This will require my utmost focus to magnify the power of my sword. I shall retire to the training grounds to make preparations. Wait for my return! Hmm, I wonder. I've never seen the guy train seriously, ever. Can that guy really handle this? Oh, well, I guess all I can do is wait here. Yep. I'll go fetch him again. Gonna have to persuade him somehow. <laughs> ah. Okay. It's no use, I can't even move. I know I told the merchant I could help, but a boulder of that size? I don't care if I'm of a legendary blood light, it's just too big. Hmm? Oh no, I can't believe I'm run out of sake at a time like this. This won't do one bit. That's it for today. I'll just have to train tomorrow. I can't train without sake to fuel the fire. Training will just have to wait till tomorrow. Why do today what can be put off until tomorrow? Wise words, Susano, wise words. I was doing things at Susano way. <laughs> sake? Mm. Okay, this really just a sake brewing girl, doesn't it? Well, I seem to have done things out of order. But you know what? That saves us some time. Because now I just gotta grab that sake and bring it back. Bring it back to old Susano. Mm -hmm. Come on. You know, sometimes I just like to sand still and pan the camera around and just look at everything. Huh! That's gonna come in handy later. Gotta remember that. That's one little, that's one thing I'd, I'd always forget. It's this little area when you get bloom or vine or whatever the hell it's called, you can come back in and gain access to that platform. Okay, I'm gonna need this. Okay, I, I, I'm, I'm not here for the love so much as the alcohol. <laughs> it's one way to live. Love? <laughs> alcohol? Yes, please. That's the, uh, the Susano way. Okay, time to inflate this douchebag's ego. Hold it right there, Fido. That smell is that Cushy's famous homebrewed sake? I offered Vista of the Gods. Against my better judgment. Fido, my friend, did you bring me some of Cushy's sake? Oh, what a glorious day. Ah, oh, good old sake. A man without drink is like a warrior without his trusty sword. Yeah. In fact, it is said that Nagi himself relied on the power of Sake in his battle with the Dread Orochi. Is it said so? It's all so clear now. Let the training begin. Alright, let's do this shit. I'll just try a bit of my usual routine. Okay, here I come. There we go. Let's begin the arduous process of 
artificially making this guy think he's the the, 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 the greatest human being to ever grace the village of Kamiki. Susano style exploding implosion! <laughs> Sounds like you just said die. Oh. Uh -oh. Man, he's fired up. Susano style exploding implosion! Ah. Nice. You did it! <laughs> That's amazing! You sliced it, you draw clean in half! You really are something! Wow, I didn't think you could do it, Pops! He whispers to Ami. I know it was really you, just humor him. Me either. Well, I mean, of course I could. I love how he, he initially just accepts it and he's like, you know what, maybe I really am that great. And as the game goes along, he starts to get <laughs> seriously concerned that something is wrong. After all, I am Suzaro, the greatest warrior ever. You weren't just showing off when you said your Nuggies descendant. Someone like you would have no trouble fighting monsters off. Huh? Well, anyway, thanks a lot. Now I can start doing business again. Ah, uh, equilibrium restored. Did you say monstrous? Zoinks! Oh, I should have given him Shaggy's voice from Scooby Doo. Oh, of course, no problem. This is a job for the most skilled warrior in all of Nippon. Yes, I shall rid these lands of their vile presence. Just sit back and watch the great Suzano work his magic. I believe I don't need to read that. He shouldn't get all puffed up. He's nothing without us. Think you'll be okay? The monsters outside the village are nasty. Ah! Glorious Amaterasu! My god, somebody stole the back off your... dress? What a pleasure to witness your heroic deeds! I am in awe! Really, it's incredible! I was just watching TV and I looked out the window and... Wow! That was insane! Oh shit, I didn't read that! To see your skills with the brushes to be witness to great art! Yeah, so do we get a reward or something, lady? You can live inside my kimono for eternity! I hardly think your participation in any impact is about. It's a soon! A soon, a soon, a soon! That called me a bug! I'll crawl back into your kimono if you say that again. <laughs> my word! Hentai! Ah, oh, relax, lady. Furball, you're more comfy anyway. Really? I suppose he's more fluffy. Let's get back to that reward thing you were talking about. Come on, Amy. Put your power up or something. Come on, shake! I must apologize. I would like to reward you, but I'm afraid I haven't the power or the money. I'm... I'm poor, you soon. I can barely muster enough energy to get out of bed in the morning. Damn you, crippling depression. I can barely muster enough strength to make a flower bloom. Good thing I'm here. Though my body stands firmly here within the confines of the village. My roots spread far and wide, protecting remote areas outside. I'm not fat though! These parts of me are known as guardian saplings. I collect the praise and adoration that gives me strength. This recent evil is eroding the guardian saplings. If this continues, I will wilt away as well and my power will vanish. Worse yet, the dark power grows stronger with each passing day. Ah, ah, ah. Ami's asleep. Yeah. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, it's totally understandable. Life as we know it will be concealed out in no time. Oh, man, this is getting heavy. Great and powerful Amaterasu, wake the hell up! Could I be so bold as to request your assistance in rejuvenating these guardian saplings by lifting the curse that enslaves them? I shall mark the locations of nearby saplings on your map. Okay, good. Yeah, that's great. I have grown tired of speaking. I haven't even the strength to speak now. I hope that my request has not fallen on deaf ears. Nope. We'll get right on it. 
Amaterasu, may the fresh scent of flowers protect you always, 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 always. Bah. I'm always itching for a good fight, but I sure don't want to poke my nose into this mess. Don't leave now, we soon the fun's just getting started. Hill, I'm stuck with Furlow here till I get all the brush skills. Ah, uh, you're using me, are you? You conniving little beetle bastard. Anyway. Oh, wait. <laughs> anyway, I'm a gardener. What could possibly go wrong? Hey, did you listen to her, Furball? You get the rest of the brush techniques to save the world. And I'll steal and learn them. Yeah, that's the trick. The ticket. The sticky wicket. I don't even... I keep giving him Sakuya's voice now. His, his voice is overlapping. At any rate, let's start by following those marks on the map. That's me saying, okay. Okay. Uh, I'll call it here for part two. Um, the dialogue is going to become less frequent the further we get into the game. So uh, if that annoys you, just keep that in mind. It doesn't annoy me. I love it. I love everything about this game. The game's fantastic. I'm marrying it in December. I'll send you guys the invitations once um, we narrow down a, an event location. All right. See you in the next video.